Chess friends, Magnus Carlsen is a number one chess player, form Norway, and his opponent is Arnish Giri. I am analyzing his beautiful queen sacrifice game, played in the event of Meltwater Chess Tournament. Okay, let's go, Arnish starts with e4. c5. Knight f3. Knight c6. Bishop b5. e6. Castle. Playing knight f6 is bad actually because of e5. Black will have a small space and his piece will become passive. So, Magnus played knight g e7. d4. c takes d4. Knight takes d4. Queen b6. Bishop e3. Knight takes d4. Bishop can't take the knight because of queen takes bishop. So, Arnish played a4, because the knight is still pinned and supporting the bishop at the same time. He is threatening to play c3. Magnus could play e5 but he chooses to play knight takes b5, sacrificing his queen for three pieces. At takes b6. Pawn can't captures the knight otherwise rook will be gone. Magnus sacrificed his queen for knight and two bishops. Knight d2 by Arnish which is a mistake. Best move was queen to d3, targeting the knight, bring out your queen frist. But he played knight d2. Knight d6. e5. Knight f5. Knight e4, inaccuracy move. Best move was knight c4, threatening the pawn and looking for d6 square. But he played knight e4, which is useless move because of knight c6. That square is protected by the bishop. So, Arnish played counterplay g4. Knight h4. f4. h5. h3. h takes g4. h takes g4. d5? e takes d6. Magnus played rook a5, bad move. Better was to play f5. Takes, takes. Black is totally fine with this structure. White king is weak because rook have open file. And black is threatening to play knight e3. But Magnus ignore this, he played rook a5. Maybe he wants rook h5 creating rook battery after settling the g-pawn. c4 by Arnish. f5. b4. Knight takes b4. d7 check. Bishop takes d7. Knight d6 check. Magnus played bishop takes knight, but better move was to play king e7. Anyway bishop takes knight. Queen takes bishop. Knight c6. Rook a d1 by Arnish, which is a mistake. Best move was queen c7, targeting both of these pawns then rook d1, firing the bishop. But he did in a wrong way, rook d1. Bishop c8. Every square is protected by the bishop and knight right. g5. Knight g6. Rook f2. King f7. Queen c7 check. Knight c7. Rook d8. Rook takes d8. Queen takes d8. Rook takes a4. Queen c7. e5. f takes e5. Bishop e6. Queen takes b7. Rook takes c4. Queen takes b6. Knight takes e5. Magnus have three pieces for a queen and black is winning because Magnus have three pieces, it can attack three different ways, I mean three multiply by three, is equal to nine. It can attack the white king in nine different attack variations. So rook e2. Rook c6. Queen e3. Knight 5 g6. King h2. Bishop c4. Rook b2. Rook e6. Queen f3. Rook e4. Rook b7. Bishop e6. King g1. Rook g4 check.
King h2. Rook takes g5. Rook b6. Bishop d5. Queen e3. Rook g2 check. King h3. Rook g4. King h2. f4. Queen d4. Rook g5. Rook d6. f3. Rook d7. Rook f5. Queen g4. Bishop e6. Rook d1. Knight e5. Queen h4. f2. King g2. Bishop d5 check. Thanks for watching subscribe for more. Bye bye. Take care, see you in my next video.